Air Force, Marines, Navy, Army, U.S. Rangers, and the Coast Guard. They didn't just put equipment on and grab guns. They sacrificed their lives. They never left a man behind. Even if they were shot, they didn't leave a man there to die. They carried them back to their base. If you have noticed, they are courageous and strong. You take off your sweatshirt because you say that you're hot, they would dare to take a helmet off. You don't want to leave your friends. They might never see theirs. When I think of Memorial Day, I think of you and how you sacrificed your life. Just take a few minutes and think of the lives. Every soldier are our heroes. And I reflect right back, I was like, she gave me this the other day and it just reflected right back to what I was saying. And I was saying, okay, it's, there are kids out there that are really catching the drift of what it's all about. So um, in the meantime, if there's anything I can help you with, I'm here to help you with as well for uh, anybody's in financial need. Um, any guidance as far as working with getting your, um, uh, anything with the VA, on the VA end, that's, that's what I'm there for. Um, I am, uh, like I said, got new things coming and going, so keep an eye on the town. Please give me all your names um, so that I can keep a list and make sure that I can get in contact with everybody on that. And in the meantime, it will go into the papers um, as new things are coming and running. So. Uh, just, do you know if, the, uh, if they recognize the VA health care system as a uh, legitimate uh, obligation to have health care? There's been contro controversy on that, and they are, they, I believe they are recognizing it. Uh, I can get a definite answer on, on that, yeah, but um, um, I, I, I don't see why it shouldn't be, to be honest with you, because it's, you're still getting to get checkups, uh, so it should be. Um, I believe they are accepting it, at, 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 are accepting it as health, as far as the taxes go. Yeah, someone asked me, and I use yeah. it, so I figured I, I um, had to go see somebody. Yeah, and as far as the tax, and it's, it's especially where the taxes are concerned, I'll definitely, um, I'm definitely getting into finding out about that as well. I guess so. Um, I actually have a conference coming up in June, and these things are all going to be brought up at the conference as well, so I will definitely have some information. So I think that'll be a big part of your... Uh, Health care and all that. Yeah. I think you, you can see a lot of that. Oh yeah. Uh, following the veterans. And there should be no reason why it's not accepted. It'd be, in my opinion, because it is health care, it is coverage. Yeah, they ever end up generalizing it anyways. You might as well look at it the same way because that's exactly what it's going to end up turning out eventually. So, but I will have these answers that that for you because uh, it's it, it's been brought up and they didn't have definites on it at the time. <clears throat> By June, we should have definite answers on all that. Um, to be actually, your 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 accountants and that they should they should be they should know of all that as well. Yeah, I don't know. Through, through, uh, through the IRS and that. So I suppose call the IRS. They could tell you. Right? You can get hold of them. <laughs> <laughs> they're, they're, that's they're a, Massachusetts, right that's a Massachusetts issue. Yeah. The Department of Revenue. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. But I, I have business cards too, so I'll, I'll get you know get them all to you folks so that you can uh, you need to get in touch with them. <coughs> all right. And you're more than welcome to come visit the office anytime. So I'll That's, walk in sometime and see if you found out about it. Or? Yeah. <coughs> right. The good news about having Susan here is now that we have a full time mm -hmm. detectives agent that is there the 35 hours a week at the same time mm -hmm. the town is open, so she will be there all the time. So I, I mean, I maintain the, the hours more times <clears throat> to be there. There's a lot of work involved in the job, um, a lot more than I think was anticipated, and a lot more I can see coming up. Um, so I, I maintain the hours to what they are posted to try to keep it there, so I can go up because I do I do make well checks on on the elderly as you still well. Have the assistant, country. the girl that no, her. I'm all by myself. She, she's no longer there? No, she's up the hot, she's up the other end of the hall. She was very helpful. Yeah, yeah. Maureen, you talking yeah, about? Maureen's good. right next door to me. She's a director of Fox and Rex. Yeah, I knew that. I yeah. Know she's, still she's great. Yeah. yeah she's my guru. <laughs> well, That's what I call her, my guru. I was one, I got a 
and I can't remember the name, but some veterans organization or a vet is that was in their mm -hmm. name, and they were looking for money, and they were saying that veterans could get help from it, and I was wondering if you knew anything about There are about so it. many organizations, and I'm going to say it, be careful. Mm -hmm. If there's something well, you're not aware of, let me know when I will, I will check with the VA and find out, because there are a lot of them out there that are just out there for your money. Well, do you and I'm not just saying VA, I'm not just saying veterans organization. I'm talking there's all kinds of organizations out there. Well, this that, wasn't necessary, yeah. was, but it had that. But I was just wondering if, if you they can get help. Not well, you. Get, you'll get you'd get help through the VA as we well, do it. You know, I, there are organizations that probably do. But actually, I, you don't to find out if they're legit. It, I would need to know the name of the, the organization. So I can research it okay. to find out if they are legit. You know, so. it's like anybody trying to you know sell things, well, I know and they're trying to. Anybody can just you yeah. Know. You, you know, it, it, when when anybody's asking for money, that's my my thing is always what we're, walk the cautious the caution line there because there, there's a lot of them out there that are out there to just take your money, and I, in, in, in any in any organization. So if you if you're curious about it, you know, let me know the information. You know, give me the information, yeah. and I'll okay. and I'll definitely Thank look you. it in, look into it for you. Find, make sure they're legit. Just a question. Maybe someone else can answer this. If not, Susan, why is carnation carnations the flowers to use on Memorial Day? Is it symbolic in any way, or is it I just don't a know seasonal if it's a, flower? Symbolic, or it's just a, a it's a Flower? A seasonal flower, and it's probably one of the cheapest flowers. Yeah. <laughs> I think there is a story I've read. But I think there is, yeah. That was the, I think that was the kind of flowers that the Confederate the mothers confed put yeah. on the graves, yeah. which started and it just kind of just evolved. There was a story there. Yeah. <clears throat> it's almost like the poppy story. Yeah, mm -hmm. right. Land is feeble. Yeah. <clears throat> Any more questions for Silk? How do you get the... Uh, Can we shut that off, Mark? <laughs> <laughs>